Hey everyone, welcome to the first episode of our Build and Deploy series where we're diving into the world of Apache Hop. Today, we're going to start from the very beginning, installing Apache Hop, creating your first project, and setting up your first environment. Apache Hop is designed for straightforward setup, no matter if you're using Windows, Linux, or Mac OS. The only prerequisite is having a Java runtime environment installed. To get started, head over to the Apache Hop website and download the latest version. Once downloaded, unzip the file to a location of your choice. Navigate to your newly unzipped Apache Hop directory. Here, you'll find everything you need to start using Hop. To launch the HopGuay, run the HopGuay.bat file if you're on Windows, or run Hop-Guay.sh for Linux or macOS. This will bring up the graphical interface where you can start building your projects. To create a new project, go to the Project menu and then select Add a new project. Give your project a name, let's call it My Hop Project. After naming your project, you'll need to set up a project home directory. This is where all your project files will be stored. Choose a directory on your system and then click OK. With your project in place, HopGUI will allow you to create a project lifecycle environment. This helps manage different phases of your project from development to testing to production. In Apache Hop, an environment describes the stage your project is in, such as development, test, or production. It also defines the configuration files you want to use, specific variables, and other environment-specific settings. To create your first environment, name your environment, for example, DevNV. You'll also need to specify the phase, like development or testing, and choose or create the configuration files that define environment-specific variables. Notice that the new environment is linked to your project, my hop project. Once your project and environment are set up, you'll see it listed in the hop GUI. You can now start creating workflows and pipelines. Some remarks before continuing. Environment files are essentially JSON files that store your configuration settings. You can select, create, and edit these environment files directly. If you specify a location for an environment file that doesn't yet exist, you'll be given the option to create it. Within your environment files, you can define variables, such as input underscore dir, to specify paths or other settings unique to the environment you're configuring. It's also possible to encrypt the values of your variables for added security. We'll delve into each of these aspects in more detail in the upcoming videos. To create another environment, go to the main toolbar in the Hop GUI and click on the Add Environment button. Name your environment, for example, TestNV. Specify the phase like testing and choose or create configuration files. And that's it. You've successfully installed Apache Hop, created your first project, and set up your environment. In the next video, we'll dive into developing your first pipelines and workflow, so be sure to stay tuned for that. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. If you have any questions, drop a comment below and we'll be happy to help.